social zones were a sign of the times during the pandemic, but what is the future of that business innovation? In downtown Grand Rapids, the barricades that hold together the social zones are getting a makeover. 13 on your side's Elena Holland spoke to one of the artists. Just a bunch of leaves right now. A little green here. There's a lot of detail that goes into leaves in general. Another shade in this spot. This is going to be the side of an Italian home. Brings to life this painting of an ivy covered villa in the Italian countryside. I can kind of create this all to look like an Italian flag. Kevin Wolfram's mural is not on a typical wall. So it was a little tricky because this is very, you know, horizontal canvas. But on the social zone barricade outside of Uccello's restaurant in downtown Grand Rapids. Kind of bring some color to the city not just have just gray barricades, you know, just sitting here. Barricades, which... Oh, it's just an eyesore. But Lions and Rabbits Center for the Arts saw these plain barriers as something else. To us, it's a blank canvas, so it's another opportunity for us to give jobs to artists. Around 40 artists are painting 127 barricades in the city this month. COVID happened. A lot of restaurants spread their outdoor seating, and now that's just, that's just like the the new normal bringing life to the pandemic era social zone and it's a good thing these artists are making these barricades a little bit more beautiful because you're going to be seeing them around town for a little longer the social zone seating areas are authorized through november 1st that's according to a city spokesperson they are temporary for now but could be extended by the city commission i think it's definitely benefiting the city generally feedback has been positive on the program but decisions have not been made yet on the long-term future of the zones i hope it uplifts people, you know, seeing, you know, new art throughout the city and, you know, just seeing kind of, you know, color come to everything. Wolfram has about a week left on his three barrier mural. Having an impact on the city and the community and just people around you, um, you know, it's a good feeling. Soon the city will be filled with more color. There's artists in every city, you know, and, you know, they need to be highlighted. And less gray concrete. Just allowing the arts to grow. In Grand Rapids, Elena Holland, 13 on your side.